So here's my poor man's grain mill. I realized I never did an update on this after uh, adding the, the motor to this. For those who haven't seen the original video, this is the, the bit that I made here. Um, basically, there's some tractor supply hardware plus a couple of bearings I got off of Amazon Prime for like five bucks a piece. A belt from tractor supply, the stock um, pulley that comes on the uh, Country Living Grain Mill. And uh, here's my motor. Rather than going anything fancy, I just went to the Lowe's and I picked up a Hitachi half-inch drill. Uh, I think it's, uh, I forget what the RPM rating is on this, but uh, it works out to be about 60, 70 RPMs um, uh, on, the, uh, on the actual mill. So, uh, see I've already done a little bit. Here's my uh, last year's harvest of uh, Cascade Ruby Gold, um, Carol Deppie's uh, um, really, really nice field corn. Uh, it's going to make an awesome cornbread, and uh, this thing gets a little loud when you turn it on, and it's got a little um, uh, keep on switch here, so I'm going to pull it back. It's probably going a little faster than I want it to go, but the grain doesn't get that hot. That's it for well, the price of the drill. I think it was about 80 bucks. The uh, stuff here, well, I mean, if I had not bought the wrong parts to begin with, probably would have been about oh, I don't know, seven, eight bucks. Man, yeah, I'll give you 20 bucks worth of parts. So for 100 bucks, I did a 300 dollar motorization on, on on my mill, and uh, I can just set it up and walk away. Bye.